No pepper, no cheese, no salsa, no nothing. Tastes like shit. <laughs> like fucking shit. Shut the fuck up and eat that shit. You gotta eat big to get big. And if you don't eat a fair amount of good food, you're not gonna get big. People ask me, how do you get into such great shape? And I go, it's pretty simple. You gotta eat like a dog. Eat like a dog, what's that mean? I go, dogs eat the same thing every day. If the owners care about them, they feed them high quality food, but they eat the same thing every day and they eat a measured amount of it. So high quality food in a measured amount every day leads to a great physique. This is fucking food, motherfucker. It's not a shake. No room for weakness. <laughs> I, I don't consider myself no different from anybody else in this world. I'm just a little bit bigger. <laughs> Train, sleep, get fucking huge. Gym, food, sleep. That's it. That's all I fucking care about. Keep the fucking food coming. I love it. To bust your ass and get it done. Not have the excuses about, well, I can't because um, I don't know how to cook. Most people are always looking for that, you know, easy way out you know a, a magic pill that's gonna give them a fucking mr olympia body in fucking two months nutrition is the most difficult part because it's uh, 24 hours uh, 365 days it's no less So we're about to put this down, and it's gym time. This is not to burn fat. You know, we're not doing this to burn fat. It makes me really hungry after I get through. Chef Dex in the house. I don't need nobody. My diet right now is pretty straightforward. Uh, I'm doing a carb cycle, about 300 grams of carbs on my high day, 20 grams of carbs on my low day. Two whole eggs, 300 grams of egg white. Gatorade, 
we got sugar oats with honey, two packets. We have rice cakes. We're trying to eat about 250, 300 carbs. You cannot overtrain the body if you are eating enough. If you're under eating, that's the only way you'll overtrain the body. There's no secrets. It's hard fucking work, cooking and eating six to ten times a day. It's hard work. There is no easy way. There's no easy way. Number one, chicken, steak, rice, potatoes, oatmeal. Where I eat 24-7. I eat through the night, I give my body sufficient nutrients all the time. Cook your egg whites, cook your oatmeal, you eat it. 12 egg whites, two cups of oatmeal. There's nothing better for breakfast than that. If I'm training for a contest, I eat clean seven days a week. I don't cheat. I will not cheat because the only person I'd be cheating is myself. Even at two or three in the morning when I get those cravings for something sweet, I don't cheat. Just like you, I know you want to do it, but if you want to be a champion, your will must be stronger than your cravings. Your will to win must be stronger than those cravings you have for those sweets and cookies or whatever it is. What are you more hungry for? It's really the question, because it was always my question. Am I more hungry to be Mr. Olympia? Or do, am I more hungry to eat like everyone else out there and therefore look like everyone else? You know, to me, I was more hungry to win this Olympia, and I was more hungry and more interested, more excited about the fact of becoming a champion and being ripped on stage. Because I knew that if I would just, you know, have a temporary joy here and eat and cheat, I am most likely not going to make it. So this is not a mistake that I want to make. I want to be responsible that I do everything that I can I'm not saying it's going to taste good, it's going to get the job done. Pebbles Day! Cocoa Pebbles and Banana. What am I missing, people? Fucking peanut butter! Ha uh ha! -huh. I know I joke around a lot. I'm funny. Ha uh ha! -huh. Funny motherfucker. I'm a crazy motherfucker. When this is over with, you know how good cake is gonna taste to me? I swear I feel for food more than I could crave a woman. And that's the truth. The thought of like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches right now just takes me over the hip. Busted. <laughs> Little cookie on the way to the gym. What the cook it down now? This is this doesn't count. This is I'm having this as a as a yummy snack because I enjoy it. I can do another hour of cardio thinking about yo in another two weeks. I'm gonna tear the hell out of some cake. I'm not gonna care about the calorie count. I'm not gonna care about how many grams of carbs are in it, how much fat, how much sugar. I'm just gonna pick it up and eat the shit and feel good about it. So I eat good six days a week in the off season. Seventh day I eat whatever the fuck I want to. That includes pizza and whatever else I want.